गुड मॉर्निंग माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स टूडे आई विल डिस्कस फ्रॉम क्लास फोर मैथ्स एट फर्स्ट आई विल टेल यू टूडे आई विल डिस्कस फॉर मल्टीपल्स एंड फैक्टर्स वट इज मल्टीपल्स एंड फैक्टर्स हाउ टू फाइंड आउट द मल्टीपल्स एंड फैक्टर्स एट फर्स्ट आई विल टेल यू वट इज मल्टीपल्स मल्टीपल्स ऑफ द नंबर आर द प्रोडक्ट वी गेट आफ्टर मल्टीप्लाइंग दैट नंबर बाई द अनादर नंबर दैट मीन्स The multiples of two, it will be two ones are two, two twos are four, two threes are six, two fours are eight, like this. Sorry, it will be eight. That means two, four, six are the multiples of two. That's why multiples of the numbers. That means multiples of the numbers. That means the multiples of two are the product. Actually, these are the product. Product. we get after multiply if we multiply 2 with 1 it will be 2 if we multiply 2 with 2 it will be 4 that means we get it we get the multiples after multiplying that the number in another number by the another number it will be called the multiples suppose it will be multiple of 3 that means the multiples of 3 that means it will be 3 ones are 3 3 twos are 6 3 threes are 9 3 fours are 12 3 fives are 15 like this so the multiples of the number it will be the in indefinite uh, that means it will be uncountable the multiples of the numbers then i will discuss you then i will told you i will tell you the common multiples for what is the common multiple that means the multiples that are the common that means here is multiples of 2 is 2 4 6 8 and here also 2 6 that means 6 is the common multiples because 6 is the multiple of 2 and also the 3 that means 6 will be the 6 will be goes as the common multiple of 2 and 3 suppose i will tell you uh, 3 and 5 3 1 is 3 6 9 12 15 here yeah. there are also 5 ones of 5 multiples of 5 it will be 5 10 15 that means 15 and the common 15 is the common multiple of 3 and 5 because we getting we are getting 15 also 3 and 5 so 15 is the common multiple of 3 and 5 this one is called the common multiple that means the number or the multiples which are the common in 3 and 5 the both and also 6 is the common multiple right over here see because 6 we should getting we should get the 6 from two multiples of 2 and multiple of 6 multiple of 3 so 6 will be the common multiple of 2 and 3 then after getting 6 it will be 12 12 also the common multiple of 2 and 3 because 12 is right over here after 12 it will be 18 in the way of common multiple find out the common multiple we should getting just one or first common multiple we should multiply with these numbers that means 6 after get after 6 it will be 6 to the 12 6 is at 18 like this uh, then i will tell you uh, 10 multiple suppose i will tell you 10 multiples of 2 that means Two ones are two. Two twos are four. Six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty. That means these are the ten multiples of two. So I will tell you again the what is common multiple. Common multiples are the numbers, the multiples which are the common in both. That means if we are taking out or if we are find out the common multiples of two and three. That means the number which are which we are getting from two and three also. That means six will be right over here. 
six is the common uh, six is the multiple of two and also three so the six will be goes as the common multiple of two and three okay then i will tell you what is factor factor that means when we multiply the two numbers that means suppose we multiply the two numbers suppose it will be three and four After multiplying, we are getting product 12. That means three, if 3 multiply with 4, 3 and 4 are the mul 3 and 4 are the factors of 12. That means when we multiply two numbers, when we multiply two numbers, suppose it will be 3 and 4, we get a product. We get a product 12. It will be each of the numbers, that means 3 and 4, each of the numbers, or each and every numbers will be the will be goes as the factor of this product or of this number that means factor after getting a multiplying the number Suppose it will be the 14, the number 14, the factors of 14 it will be 1, 14 and 14 also, 2 multiply with 7, if we are getting 14, 2 multiply with 7, that means 2 and 7 are the factors of 14, suppose it will be 16, then also 2 is at 16 and also we are getting 4 4 is at 16 that means 4 2 4 and 8 are the factors of 16 factor that means when we multiply the numbers or multiply two numbers we get a product each of the numbers it is called the factor of this product or of this number that means I will tell you what is factor. Factor that means the both of the numbers after multiplying the product we are getting some numbers it will be the these numbers will be goes as the factor. Suppose it will be 8 that means 1 is the 8 2 4 is 8 that means 1 2 and 4 and also 8 will be goes as the factor of 8 that means by which number you can divide this that number it will be goes as a factor so if i will tell you if i will ask you to find out the factor of 36 by the division way and also here is two ways are there one is division and second one is multiply division that means we are divide by the numbers That means the factor of 36 will be goes as 2, 3, 4, 5. We cannot divisible, we cannot divide by 5 with 36. So it will be not a factor of 36. 5 will be not goes as factors of 36. We can also divide by 6. So the 6 will be goes as the factor of 36. These are also the factor of 36. That means 9, 12, 18. So the factor of 36 is 1, 2, 3, 4. By which number we can divide 36? These are the factors of 36. 4, then 6, then it will be 9, 12, and 18 at last. These are the factors of 36.
This one is called the division method. Division method. By this division method, we can find out the factors like this. And also multiplying method. Multiplying method, that means 36. 1, 36, 36. 2, 18, 36. 3, 12, 36. 4 nines are 36, 6 is are 36, 9 already goes, but these are the factor of 36, that means at first, at first I will tell you the factors of 36 always it will be 1 and itself, after that 2, 3, 4, 6, 12, 9, 18. These are the factors of 36. This one is called the multiplying method. Oh, sorry. This one is called the multiplying method and this one is called the division method. Next and last, so these are from class, uh, from exercise 6, a 1, 2, 3 are your homework and I will tell you using number line how to find out the multiples. Then number 6, b, 1 and 2, your homework. You should do your homework at your copy. Using the number line how to find out the multiples. <clears throat> now I will tell you the using number line. Using the number line, find out the multiples, common multiples, sorry. This one is called the number line. Suppose I will ask you find out the common multiples of 2 and 3 using by the number line. That means keep counting also 2 and 3. Keep counting that means you will count the table. Obviously it will be start from 0. At first we will count the tables. Keep counting of 2. 2 ones are 2. 2 2 is a 4, 2 3 is a 6, 2 4 is a 8, 2 5 is a 10, and 2 6 is a, it will be 12. Then also, I will show the skip counting of 3, that means it will be start from 0. 0 to 3. 3 1s are 3, 3 2s are 6, 3 3s are 9, and 3 4s are 12. That means here also the common, this one is called the common multiples. That means 2 and 3 will be skipped together here, number 6. So the 6 is the common multiple of 2 and 3 by the using number line and also here also uh, 2 will be goes as also 12 and 3 also will be goes as 12 so the 12 will be goes as the common multiples of 2 and 3 like this you should do the common multiples or you should find out the common multiples of both of the numbers of two numbers using by the number line 
So these are the all about today's class. So thank you so much. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much, my dear.